In this tutorial, you will learn how to generate layouts from a 3D model and add dimension to projected views from a 3D object. I'm going to maximize this one. So this is a drawing I did earlier. And to generate a layout, go to the Layout tab, right click, and select from Template, double click Sheet Sets. And since we are using millimeters, I'm going to choose Manufacturing Metric and click Open and click OK. Go back to the Layout tab, click ISO 83 Title Block and click Layout up here. And uh, for Styles and Standards, click this Flyout and select Third Angle Projection and click OK. Now inside the Create View panel, you can find Base. Click this drop down arrow and select from Model Space from AutoCAD. Click here. So this is going to be the parent view, which is also the front view. Click Exit. Move your cursor upward. Click. So this is the top view. Click here for the isometric view and sideways for the side view. You can also change the scale to every view by going to the parent view, which is this one. So just double click, click scale and enter 1.5. I'm going to bring back the original scale. And to change the appearance of the isometric view, double click, click hidden lines and select shaded with visible lines. You can do the same to every view. And to generate a section view, go back to the create view and select section, click top view, hover over from the midpoint and move your cursor slightly to the left, click, move to the right, click again, enter, and move your cursor downward and click and click exit. You can move this one somewhere here. And you can also generate a section view from this view. Just hover over from the midpoint, click, downward click, enter, and move sideways. And you can also do detail uh, let's choose this view, click here, and click somewhere here, and exit. You can also change the size for individual views by double-clicking this one, select Scale, and you can enter 1.5. Now the next thing to do is apply dimensions. So I'm just going to delete this one. To apply dimension, go to home first. And check layer properties. And as you can see here, AutoCAD automatically provided layers for the layouts, I'm going to create a new layer for dimension and type DIM for dimension and click this box to change the color, red color, click OK and close. Now go to annotate over here and make the dim dimension current. And to change the dimension style, click this fly out. And you can click Modify. You can change the text, the primary units, and change this one to comma or period. Click OK and click Close. Uh, for linear, in point to in point. I'm going to change the size of the text. So Modify. 
text. I'm going to change this to 3.5. Enter. Click OK. Another linear. And for diameter, click that. Right click to repeat diameter. And uh, what else? And you can do the rest. And I think that's it for now. See you again for the next tutorial. And please uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and bell icon for notification. And by the way, I'm going to recreate this 3D in my next tutorial. I did this a while back, but uh, there was no sound. And a subscriber requested for a new one, a better one. So see you again. Thanks for watching.